Hey everyone, welcome back to Arduino Intro, where we explore fun and educational projects with Arduino. In today's video, we're going to learn how to use a soil moisture sensor with an Arduino to monitor the moisture levels in your plants. We'll also use an LED to visually indicate when your plant needs watering. Let's get started. A soil moisture sensor is a device that measures the amount of water present in the soil. It's a handy tool for gardeners, farmers, or anyone who wants to monitor the moisture levels of their plants. The sensor typically consists of two probes that you insert into the soil. These probes act like resistors, whose resistance changes with the moisture content in the soil. When the soil is dry, the resistance between the probes is high. When the soil is wet, the resistance decreases. Our soil moisture sensor has four pins, VCC, GND, digital output pin, and analog output pin. For this project, we will be using the analog output pin. Here are the components you'll need for this project. An Arduino board, I'll be using an Arduino Uno, a soil moisture sensor, an LED, a 220 ohm resistor, breadboard and jumper wires. All right, let's move on to the wiring. First, let's connect our soil moisture sensor. Connect VCC to the 5V pin on the Arduino, GND to the ground pin, and the analog output pin to A0 on the Arduino. Next, we'll connect the LED. Connect the shorter leg of the LED, the cathode, to one end of the 220 ohm resistor. Connect the other end of the resistor to the GND rail on the breadboard. Connect the longer leg, the anode, of the LED to pin 7 on the Arduino. Let's go ahead and assemble this circuit. Now that we have everything connected, let's move on to the code. This is the code we'll be using for this project. Let's go through the code step by step. First, we define the pins for the soil moisture sensor and the LED. Next, we declare a variable to store the sensor value. In the setup function, we initialize the serial communication at a baud rate of 9600 and set the LED pin as an output. In the loop function, we start by reading the analog value from the soil moisture sensor. We then print this value to the serial monitor. Next, we check if the soil is dry. If the sensor value is greater than 500, we turn the LED on. Otherwise, we turn the LED off. Let's upload the code to our Arduino and see it in action. Select your board and port and hit upload. Once the code is uploaded, open the serial monitor to see the soil moisture values. When the value is above 500, indicating dry soil, the LED will turn on. When the value is below 500, indicating moist soil, the LED will turn off. And there you have it. A simple yet effective way to monitor your plant's soil moisture using an Arduino. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Arduino Intro for more exciting Arduino projects. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. Happy tinkering!